First of all, you're gonna sound dampen the wall with a 10 kg per meter squared self-adhesive tech sound. Now this is a viscoelastic membrane which basically sound dampens the wall, just like we do with the 20 mil rubber, but a thinner version of it. Next, we're gonna install battens and here we're gonna use a 2B2 batten on anti-vibrational pads. Not a foam tape, it's an anti-vibrational pad which separates the batten from the wall, but you're still gonna mechanically fix those battens to the wall. Next, we're gonna insulate the battens with a 50 mil rock wall like this, and then we're gonna install resilient channels to those battens. But before we do that, we're gonna coat the battens with a mass-loaded vinyl. The mass-loaded vinyl has gotta be a five kg per meter squared mass-loaded vinyl. The resilient bars then go over the top of that. That. You can staple the barrier mat to the battens uh, and that'll be fine and then put the resilient bars over the top of that. Next, install two layers of 15 mil acoustic grade plasterboard and always install two layers to two layers of something when you install a resilient bar or a resilient clip or channel system. When I say two layers of something, I mean either two layers of sound block board or maybe consider putting a fiber board and then a layer of 15 mil sound block board or maybe even consider three layers. You use a, a cement board, then a fiber board, and then a 15 mil sound block board. And you can always upgrade the layers by sandwiching a, I can't even say sandwich, and you can always upgrade the layers by installing a mass loaded vinyl between the two layers of 15 mil sound block board, for example, or installing a, uh, a tech sound between the two layers of board which you choose. But never install one layer because if you install one layer to a resilient bar or resilient channel system, what you'll find when you plaster the wall, it will just really, really crack. You'll have cracks all down the board joins and all around the edges because there's just too much movement. Right, but this particular system, system number five, Oh, this system is a hundred mil thick and of course you, you can it depends if you use a clip and channel system that's going to be a lot thicker so a hundred mil thick is based on using resilient bars and this system will offer if you install it to the direct noise path of the separating party wall alone tucking it up tucking it down it will offer you a 70 percent human perceived reduction in noise that's airborne noise coming through for that impact noise you're looking more like 50 percent reduction in noise we're now talking more about the impact noise and those structural bore noises because we've used a resilient bar and that's what those resilient bars and resilient channels do is they deal with the lower frequencies of noise those clonks and clangs and that bass noise coming through if you want to stand a chance at reducing that type of neighbor noise coming through then you really need to consider using resilient bars or resilient channel system this is a really good system if you have that four inches of space available and it's a popular system that we install to bedrooms to reducing that room to room transfer of noise. For example, you've got someone gaming the other side of that bedroom wall and you're trying to sleep and you don't have that much space available, then this is a great system to install maybe to the alcoves either side of a chimney stack and then maybe install one of the 50 mil two inch systems around the chimney stack. Because the battens are still mechanically fixed to the wall, you're not gonna get much more than a 50% reduction in those impact noises. So if you're hearing doors banging, furniture moving, that sort of noise, then you are still gonna hear that noise come through this system, but it will start taking the edge off of those impact noises. Remember to check the links in the description down below. Get yourself a free copy of the book, The Noise Free Home. If you're a DIYer, builder, or homeowner, and you want to learn how to install these systems yourself, then why not consider the Soundproofing Secrets course or even the big of course the noise free DIY soundproofing course the soundproofing secrets course is on offer at the moment let us know how you get on in the comments down below and I'll see you on the next video